In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called graphing a parabola of the form y equals ax squared plus bx plus c integer coefficients. We're given the parabola y equals 2x squared plus 20x plus 48, and we're asked to graph it by finding five points the vertex, two points to the left, and two points to the right. So I'll start by finding the vertex, which I know will go through the axis of symmetry. And we should recall that the equation for the axis of symmetry when we have this sort of standard form is the line with the equation x equals negative b over 2a. So from the standard form we're going to be plugging in a and b. Here those values are 2 and 20. So if we replace our b with 20 and our a with 2, we would have negative 20 over 4. So our axis of symmetry is x equals negative 5. So we know that our parabola will be symmetric across the line y equals negative 5. So we're going to be plugging in values here. We're going to plug in 5 x's. We want one of them to be that negative 5. We want two numbers to the left, maybe negative 6 and negative 7. Two numbers to the right, negative 4 and negative 3 will work. And we want to plug in these five values into our y function. And we're going to replace those x's with the values we have here, starting with minus 7. So if I replace the x's with minus 7, we would have 2 times negative 7 squared is 49. 20 times negative 70 is minus 140. Bring down the plus 48. 2 times 49 is 98 minus 140 plus 48. 98 minus 140 is a negative 42. Plus 48 gives us 6. So when we plug in a negative 7, we get 6. So we have our first point, negative 7, 6. Repeating the process now with negative 6, we'll be substituting in a negative 6. So we start with 2 times negative 6 squared, which is 36. 20 times negative 6, negative 120, plus 48. This gives us a 72 minus 120, plus 48. Doing the subtraction here first, 72 minus 120 gives us a negative 48, plus 48. So we have 0 here, negative 6, 0. So that's our second point. Next, we will substitute negative 5, negative 5. So this would be 2 times negative 5 squared is 25. 2 times negative 5, negative 100, plus 48. This would be 50 minus 100, plus 48. Negative 50 plus 48 would give us a negative 2. So we have our third point. The next point is when x equals negative 4. Negative 4 squared is 16, so 2 times 16. 20 times negative 4 is a negative 80, plus 48. 2 times 16 is 32, minus 80, plus 48. 32 minus 80 would be a minus 48, plus 48 would be 0. This is the value we were expecting since it should be symmetric. Our last point here is when x equals negative 3. That substitution gives us 2 times negative 3 squared, so 2 times 9. 20 times negative 3, a minus 60, plus 48. 2 times 9 is 18, minus 60, plus 48, minus 42, plus 48. So 6, our last point is negative 3, 6, also shows that symmetry, and our shape would be like this.